Do you want more idiots in your colony, but don't have the patience to wait on your citizens building them for you? I mean, I assume that's how new citizens are made. It would certainly explain the strange noises that come from their houses at night anyway. Well, you're in luck, as with the help of the best building within your colony, you can recruit new idiots to join your colony at only the small cost of a few potatoes or a handful of diamonds. In this short tutorial, we'll cover the basics of this superb building, explaining everything that you'll ever need to know about the Mine Colony's Tavern. The tavern is one of the first builds you should consider placing down upon starting your colony. It offers shelter and housing for all of your starting colonists without the need to place down proper housing for them. The tavern encourages visitors to drop by it, which you can then recruit them to your colony, adding their numbers to your ever-growing population. These visitors are normally quite well skilled, usually more so than the riffraff that you start off with. So definitely worth your time checking out a new visitor's stats especially if you're after a highly skilled worker. The tavern building block can be created by using a barrel vertical block, or a normal barrel depending on which version of the mod that you are playing on, alongside some wooden planks of any type, and a building tool. You can only have one tavern in your colony at a time, unless you use creative mode and build another although this is not advised. Once constructed, visitors will occasionally turn up to it and either wander about or sit on the furniture around it. You can interact with these visitors, who will let you know what type of items they would require in order for you to recruit them to your colony. The items and quantities requested will vary depending on the overall skills of the visitor, which you can check out their stats from their citizens interface. The tavern can house up to a maximum of 4 citizens, regardless of which tier it is at. To give this some perspective, a citizen house at tier 1 can only house one citizen, and would need to be upgraded to tier 4 in order to house 4 citizens. Granted, unlike a citizen's house, you can only ever have one tavern at a time within your colony. Citizens will head to the tavern and use the beds within it at night, as they would do with a normal house. The visitors that arrive at the tavern do not sleep, so will not require a bed, and will just simply return back to the tavern at night and wait until morning. It is also possible for your citizens to have children whilst housed within the tavern. Unlike most builds, the tavern only has three tier upgrades to it, unlike the usual five that most buildings have. The number of visitors to the tavern will increase as the tier of the tavern increases. A visitor's skills will also increase as the tavern's tiers increase, but so too will the items and quantities requested to recruit them. After a few days, older visitors to the tavern will get hungry and will leave. Whenever this happens, a new visitor with different skills and requests will then take their place for you to recruit if you wish. Visitors do not eat, even if you place food into their inventories, their food status bars are mainly acting as timers until they disappear from your colony. As a little word of warning, visitors will attack you if you provoke them first, and they can be quite relentless in their efforts. The tavern's interface is very simple. From the top ribbon bar, you can view the name of the tavern and its upgrade level, unless you have renamed the building. You can also see a list of citizens who stay at the tavern, and unassign them from the build to remove them from living there, or assign a citizen to stay there if you wish. The build options will show you what is required to upgrade the tavern, as well as options to repair or deconstruct it. You can recall all citizens who live at the tavern straight back to it, by pressing the Recall Citizens option. The Inventory button will show you what type of items are in the building's hut storage, 
with the chest icon beside it, allowing you to search for a specific item. And that is everything about the fantastic tavern build. You can certainly get your hands on some highly skilled idiots from here, or just an extra helping hand if your own citizens aren't building their children quick enough for you. To end, here is a nice showcase of all of the different tier 3 taverns that you can make. Enjoy, and I hope this tutorial has helped.